I got up at 5 30 because I had to go to the bathroom do I want to get up or do I want to roll over and go back to sleep I'm gonna get up and get back to work yeah I'm up early hello and welcome to lifestyle Colin YouTube channel my name is Colin and I am back in your algorithm with the vibes if you are a returning subscriber welcome and hello if you are new to my channel thank you so much for clicking on this video and spending time with me today please subscribe to my channel and vibe with the guys okay so i am so excited about today's vlog i'm still in my um my lash office and we in this one little spot right now because i have not gotten to the place where i'm comfortable putting my home out on the internet just yet but we getting there i know this is a vlog so i'm going to take y'all around and do what i do every day but today is special because it is the first day in a very 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 long time that i have gotten up this early it is currently 8 36 and i got up at 5 30 this morning i got up at 5 30 because i had to go to the bathroom and i laid there and i was like do i want to get up or do i want to roll over and go back to sleep so i was like you know what i want this to be the first day that i um I was like, I want this to be the first day that I start getting back up early. Now, I will tell you, um, when I've had my first, one of my first major, major shifts in my life that I can actually remember, like in my 30s, I was getting up every morning at 5 o'clock. I was getting up at 5 o'clock, going and taking a bath, um... And just getting ready, I was really heavy on Instagram at the time. So my followers obviously don't reflect that. But the influence that I have had on the eyelash industry, you can see it. Um, and now I'm at the point where I want my followers to start reflecting my influence on the whole eyelash industry. But we'll get there um, in a minute. But today I was like... I'm gonna get up and get back to work now I will tell you this too like I'm not afraid of work I, I love to work especially because for I've been doing what I enjoy doing for a very long time so it this doesn't feel like work to me but um, I will tell you what has been holding me back the roach infestation in the in low income apartments the two low income apartments that i have lived in um the first one i didn't have roaches for that long but before i was able to get rid of them but in this apartment i was like i don't want to get up and deal with the whole bunch of roaches like the way that my daughters and i are now like we keep a can of raid or cans of raid one in the kitchen one in the bathroom and if one of us sees a roach, we say, we say, you know, we call and tell the other person to bring us some ray or if, or, you know, so I don't like, and I let my girls sleep until they wake up. They're homeschooled, so they don't have to get up at the crack of dawn, you know, to get ready for school or nothing. So I let them sleep. Then we do our schoolwork and they don't go to bed until all their work is done, of course, but they can get up whenever they want to. So I just lay in the bed with my girls. I'm like, I'm not getting up unless my girls are up so one of them can hurry up and bring me some raid if I need it. Or if one of them sees a bug, we can we, we tag team like that. We help each other kill the bugs. So um, that's why I haven't been getting up early. Now I will say, I was like, you know what? I want this to be the first day that I start getting up early again. So today is October... 19th of 2023 and i feel like this is a special month because we have every day this month started off the first started off on sunday october 1st 2023 the very first day so i feel like this month is special and we also had a friday the 13th in this month last week 
I didn't vlog that week. I'm getting better. I'm going to try to start vlogging, like I said, every day. But it's just a day-by-day -day process. I'm taking it one day at a time. So today, um, I'm just, I just am happy that I got up so early in the morning because I feel like I'm getting back to my old self as far as being an entrepreneur. I've worked for myself for a very long time. And now it's time for me just to start getting my income back to where, you know, I don't qualify for food. I, my prayer has been, I make so much money that I don't qualify for food stamps. Um, I do want to keep my Section 8 because there's some things that I want to accomplish with my Section 8. I want to try out, um, but that's, that's, I'll get to that when I, when I get there. But um, I'm a very appreciative of all the resources that are afforded to me right now. But um, yeah, I'm up early. I'm up early. It is 841 and I'm like, okay. So I got up this morning. I contemplated. I did hit snooze one time. I was like, you know what? I'm going to hit snooze. And so I went, I got up at 5.30 and I lay back down and then I got up like maybe like 6, it was between 5.30 and 6, so I hit snooze one time. But my alarm clock was not set for 5.30, my alarm clock was actually set for 6 o'clock. But I got up at 5.30 to use the bathroom and I knew my alarm clock was set for 6, so I was like... Let me go ahead and just kind of stay up so that I get up when my alarm clock goes off. And I did. I got up. I took a shower. Um, normally, I would take a bath. But like I said, these roaches. And I did see a roach on the door of the bathroom when I got up. But I, the raid was right there. So I killed it. All roaches get sprayed. You know how I go. But I'm in a place where I am coming out of living with roaches. So... That's just my challenge right now, and I'm I'm actually um, really enjoying it. But the thing about you having a YouTube income is you really have to be on. You have to have you because YouTube, you know, your channel can get demonetized. There's so many things with depending on a YouTube income, where I want multiple streams. Now I don't want to just depend on YouTube my YouTube income. So. Um, today I will be working on, of course, I have another video that I've been working on the last couple of days for my business YouTube channel. Um, and let me go to it here so you can follow me on Mink by Colin at Mega Volume Lashes. Let me put it up here so you can see what it is. Also, um, I want to start consistently creating content for this channel, Lifestyle Colin. And um, I'm also working on something for my lash business that I really, really think the girls are going to like. Um, and so that's what I'm working on. But I want it to be really, really thought out and really, really, you know, done really well. So that's why I'm taking my time with it. I'm not rushing it at all. Um, so, yeah. Okay, this is my... business YouTube channel and I'm doing a series I'm doing a series um, for because it's called becoming a lash tech and I'm really enjoying it because I am able to walk step by step with other people who want to become lash techs because I'm having to start all over again like my life my esthetician license is expired so i'm gonna have to take my state board exam all the way over again i have a video coming up on my um, business channel about preparing for state board you have to take a written and a practical exam but i said i'm not going to rush myself i'm going to take my time and really just thoroughly study and thoroughly prepare because i don't want to burn myself out by trying to study for it and go take it next week and even though i will pass and stuff like that you know i want to i have two kids now so me my hustle is a little bit different to where before i would just go hurry up and take the test or whatever and and get licensed now i have to make sure that my girls work is done um that they understand their work because now i'm a mom first so I don't want to burn myself out and I don't want to burn myself out by opening up a new lash studio either. I want it to be something where 
I really enjoy my work. I really enjoy what I'm doing. And that's where I am right now. And that's where I wanted to stay. So I don't want to start putting a whole bunch of things on my plate. And I burn myself out, which I have done before, you know, by trying to take a whole bunch of clients just to have, you know, just to get your money up. And then you'd be like, you know, you take it all these clients and then you tired, you have kids that have to be cared after you have money, but you know, you're tired. So that's why I'm glad that I've actually done this before because, um, I know about burnout and I'm not I'm not doing that but I'm gonna take it one day at a time step by step and and keep going so I just want to encourage you like if there is a goal that you want to accomplish that you see for yourself um, that you want to do you know just take it step by step take it slow and don't burn yourself out by trying to hurry up and do it or anything like that just allow the Lord that's my biggest message just allow God to lead you and um and 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 do what he be obedient to him and do what he says to do. Um what else did I want to talk about? That's really it. This has been like a 10 minute video, which um my vlogs will um I my goal is for them to be a little bit longer, but I don't want to talk your ear off about you know something. Oh my gosh, I will tell you that these Shein little outfits, I'm still little y'all, I still ain't got no way, but these little outfits are so cute. Like this is what I be around the house in. These little Shein, I don't know if you can see, let me try to move my camera back a little bit, but I don't want my camera to fall off the table. But um, yeah, these little Shein. If you can see it, it's like a little, these are so comfortable. I'm still an extra small. Ooh. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing for today around the house. Um, the, I'm still in an extra small. So I'm probably gonna order some more of these. I have some more that I get that I just kick around the house in and I love these. This is, so I'm an extra small comfortably. Um, a smile is a little too big, so I normally sleep in a smile because it's kind of baggy. I mean, so I sleep in my small outfits that I still have left. I have some mediums and uh, in the closet that are just too big. I probably won't wear those. I probably end up giving all that stuff away. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to get started on content. I've been working on some content for my Instagram and for my TikTok. For, I'll probably start consistently going hard with Instagram and TikTok probably at the beginning of the new year 2024. I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to burn myself out. I am going to commit to my two YouTube channels right now and just see where that goes this one still needs to get to a thousand followers and four thousand watch hours my other one is eligible for monetization so um and i have the lord i'm so glad i got up early this morning because the lord gave me a really really good idea to do on that channel and i'm just going to start working towards all the ideas i've had for that channel and just take my time with them i'm not gonna at first I was trying to like post every day and I could do that but um the video that I'm working on right now I want it to be really done really well so that's why it's taking me a couple of days to finish up the next video that I have for Mega Volume Lashes YouTube channel but for me by Colin Mega Volume Lashes YouTube channel but I just wanted to check in um with this channel for today Please hit the subscribe button. Um, please like this video so it will do well in the algorithm. Thank you so much for spending some time with me this morning. What else do I have to do today? I have to go get something to make for dinner from the store. I'm thinking Sloppy Joes for tonight, but I don't know. So I love Sloppy Joes. I love Sloppy Joes. We love Sloppy Joes. So it might be a Sloppy Joes night. Just because it's easy and quick. So I, that's probably what it's going to be tonight. I might take y'all with me to the store. 
Um, my, I don't know. I have to get used to vlogging because I'm not going to be able to stay in this one spot. But for right now, I'm just getting used to editing and uploading and um and i and so and shout out to one subscriber that i got from my last video that was definitely motivation for me to to keep going so thank you so much for watching like i said um please like this video share this video with the friends comments comment what what you have going on i would love to know what other people um who watch this channel are up to and i will see you tomorrow thank you so much for watching lifestyle calling youtube channel please like share comment and subscribe